Let's talk about a special kind of layer, a smart object, when we can convert a layer into a smart object. And I will show you why. Here we have just a regular pixel-based layer. If I do a free transform, that's Command T, Control T on a PC, and I shrink this layer down, quite small. As soon as I click the check mark or press the return key, it has reprocessed that so that it would fit in that small space. If I do a Command T on it, you'll notice that that image is at 100% of its size already. And if I try to stretch it up by 1,100% or so and I hit return, you'll see that I've lost most of the quality of the, of the image. That's the purpose of a smart object. I'm going to undo until we get back to the original. There. We can turn a layer into a smart object by right mouse button clicking on it and choosing Convert to Smart Object, or you can do so in the Layers menu as well. And let's do that same task. We'll transform it. We'll take it down to oh, about 7% of its size and hit return. And then when I transform it again, you'll notice that instead of being 100%, it's showing as 7%. That's because Photoshop has saved that file in a special place that keeps it at its full resolution. So I can take that up as long as I don't go over 100%. I'm not losing any quality of that image, and so when I press return again, you'll notice that the image is just like we started. Now, there are some things you can't do with a smart object. One of them is you can't paint on it. You can do almost anything else, though. You can mangle it by transforming it. You can add uh, uh, non-destructive filters to it. In order to actually change this image, you have to go to its special hiding place, and, and you do that by double-clicking on it. You'll see that it just opened that layer in a new document here, and then I can paint on it, and when I try and close the document, it says, do you really wish to save this? If I say yes, then that's part of the smart object, and it becomes part of the smart object as well. So that's the purpose of a smart object, is to protect an image so that you can do things and still maintain that uh, pristine state that you had it in when you first opened it up.